Today, I've got the key to Bella, the Block's 1956 Bel Air sports sedan project. At the heart of Bella is an LS3 connecting cruise put out by Chevrolet Performance. This comes with the engine, the transmission, and all the control units you need to retrofit such a powertrain into an old girl like Bella. The LS3 is rated at 430 horsepower and offers the lightweight advantage of an aluminum cylinder block, aluminum heads, and a composite intake manifold, which can reduce the curb weight and improve the weight balance of your older vehicle, just like our Bella. The Connect and Cruise package is backed by the 4L65E automatic transmission, which has proven fantastic for highway cruising performance as well as fuel economy. The system also comes complete with the engine control system, the torque converter, transmission control system, and the 4L60 installation kit, making it perfect for a project like this. We're gonna take her for a leisurely spin today, and I'm gonna give you some first impressions on the LS3 in general, the transmission, and then we may go stop and talk to the guy that put it all in Bella. Let's go for a spin. All right, so first impressions driving Bella. Immediately, I'm blown away with the torque. I mean, you just you just lay into the throttle and she takes off. A 56 Bel Air sports sedan, I think I had a shipping weight of probably around 3,400 pounds. We're probably close to that with an all aluminum motor. But then we also have 430 horsepower now. With so much power on tap, you know, you don't really have to ring out the motor. You know, climb the revs, get going, get on the on-ramp. You just quarter throttle. I mean, that's what everyone at the office is talking about. Quarter throttle is all we've been needing to get up to speed and maintain speed with traffic of modern cars. Once you get past the first bit of torque, and you start climbing in the revs, the power just grows exponentially. So when you've got low end torque and you've got high end horsepower, it's really the perfect package. I'd like to know what it was like to install this connected cruise. I mean, I didn't install it, so we're gonna go talk to Daniel Valjevac at Retro Design Speed and Custom in Concord, North Carolina. Maybe we can get the lowdown on what he really thought about this connected cruise powertrain. Hey Daniel, how are you? Good, how are you, man? Thanks for letting us swing by the shop. No problem. We're, uh, I've been out cruising in Bella, and we're kind of talking about the LS3, the Connect and Cruise, but we want to come and talk to you about what the actual install is like. So when you were first approached with the idea of an LS3 Connect and Cruise, what were your thoughts? Well, when I was first contacted by you guys, you know, you guys said Connect and Cruise, you know, I thought nothing's Connect and Cruise. So we started looking at, at the whole kit, everything was labeled, all the wiring was done nicely, all the connectors, everything. Once we started installing, everything kind of fell in place with no problems at all. All the wires kind of guided themselves where they need to be and everything was labeled. And you get in the car, you just turn the key, it goes, it drives. It drives like a brand new car, no problems. Uh, the performance is awesome. You know, anybody that's looking for a reliable engine package with some performance, I would definitely recommend. I, I can see a guy in his garage doing this setup or professional, you know. Uh, it's very simple, directions are great, tech support is awesome. So I would just say, get it and put in pretty much anything you want. All right guys, well there you have it. You've got our impressions of the LS3 connecting crews as well as the professional builders on installing the LS3. If you've got any questions, call your local Chevrolet dealer or hop on over to www.theblock.com and you can learn more about it as well. Till next time. <laughs>